The concept of the U3 Award was the result of a couple GSCO members, Jason Price and outfitter Jake Franklin, wanting to recognize young hunters and their achievements and get them involved in GSCO as the next generation of hunters and conservationists. They presented the idea to the GSCO board and it was a unanimous decision to begin the program. The criteria for the U3 Award is simple. Any young person under the age of 18 who takes an antlered species, a horned species, and a predator species from the U3 list can qualify for this award. 2021 will be the first year we honor those who have achieved the U3 milestone. Forrest Browning is up first, and he began his quest for the U3 with a Kansas white-tailed deer taken in 2017. He drew a youth desert bighorn tag in his home state of New Mexico later that year and took a great ram when he was just six years old. Forrest achieved his U3 in 2018 with a black bear, also from New Mexico. Next up is Gavin Carrizales, and his first trophy was a mule deer from Nebraska taken in 2018 with his grandfather, Tom Lundgren, as his guide. For the predator category, Gavin connected on a coyote in Nebraska in February 2020, and he finished his U3 in October 2020 with Wyoming pronghorn. Granddad Tom was on each hunt with Gavin. We are pleased to recognize Shea Gridanus for achieving her U3 milestone. First up, you see Shea with her huge black bear from British Columbia, taken in 2017. Later that year, Shea connected on a Columbia black-tailed deer in California. As for the horned species, Shea completed her U3 with an Alaska doll sheep in August of 2019. Well, not to be outdone, Shea's brother Trent Gridanus is also a recipient of a U3 milestone. Trent's first entry for the U3 program was a pronghorn antelope from Nevada taken in 2018. Later that year, Trent hunted cougars in Utah and scored on a fine cat. He achieved his U3 in October 2019 with a great Shiras moose in Idaho. We'll be right back after these messages. Ryan Humes is up next, and we'll start with the coyote she got in Nevada back in 2017. The next two animals on her U3 quest were both taken on the same hunt in NWT in July 2019. First is her great doll sheep. Four days later, Ryan connected on a full velvet mountain caribou to round out her U3 milestone. It took Cody Moore only three months from start to finish to get the required animals for his U3 milestone. In August 2019, he traveled to New Mexico and connected on a pronghorn antelope. In November of that same year, he added a mule deer as well as a cougar to his U3 list. It's worth mentioning that all three of Cody's trophies came from New Mexico. In 2016, Matthew Mueller used a shotgun to take his Illinois whitetail as his first U3 entry for the antlered category. The following year, 
He connected on a New Mexico pronghorn. And in 2019, at the age of 10 years old, Matthew completed his U3 with a black bear, which he got on a hunt in Virginia. We're pleased to recognize Trapper Rasmussen for completing the U3. Trapper's first entry was a Rocky Mountain Elk from Utah taken self-guided with his family in 2018. A couple months later, Trapper used his pistol to take an alligator in Florida for his predator category. Trapper finished up the U3 in 2019 with the Wyoming Pronghorn. Dylan Ray is up next to receive his U3. He was just seven years old when he took a coyote on a hunt in New Mexico for his predator category. Dylan took a Kansas whitetail in 2019 for the antler category, and he achieved his U3 milestone with an Aldad from West Texas in March 2020 at the age of nine years old.